Hey Glamazons, it's me, and this is take three for this video. Oh my god, guys, I'm having the worst hair day ever. I washed my hair, I didn't flat iron it, and it's a huge puffy mess. I actually have half of it pinned up. I don't know if you guys can see back there. Yeah, I've got a bun back here. This is ridiculous. My hair needs Jesus. Like, seriously? I need Jesus right now, guys. Seriously. Mm. Anyway, <laughs> uh, it's just ridiculously puffy, and I just didn't even feel like flat ironing it, because if I flat iron my hair, I won't have any, so I try not to uh, put a lot of heat on it. D do, you, do you see this? Like, Do you see this? I've got frizz, I've got puff, I, I, I don't know guys. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> that's not what this video is about. This isn't a hair video. I was sent a package of jewelry to review. Nice little box right here without flashing you guys my address. And this jewelry was from dhgate.com. So that's going to be D is in dog, H is in Harry, gate, G-A-T-E dot com. And this is a website based in China. They're based in China. And there's no bidding, so it's not like eBay. I guess it's kind of like Amazon. You can pretty much find almost anything there. Um, except, honestly, this place is... The more you buy, the more you save. So I would suggest this place, if you're running an internet store or a physical store, this is where you would go to get your merchandise. Because it's better if you buy like a dozen, two dozen. It's more wholesale if you ask me. Instead of ordering, um, go. I wouldn't necessarily go there and order one piece of jewelry. Because, you know, hey. But anyway, let's get started. They sent me, they let me pick a few items out of a list of 12. Like they reached out to me via YouTube and contacted me via email. So it's this necklace here. Really, really pretty gunmetal chunky chain. It's mesh and it is metal. It's not plastic, it's metal. And you can see it's a really, really big uh, chain. I wore this. I received this jewelry about a month ago and I've been testing it out and um, you'll you'll hear what I have to say this is really good quality and I think it's very sparkly it's very nice you know good quality I'm tugging on it and nothing's happening to it it's not too heavy but it's not chintzy and I think this would be great for a holiday party I think this would be great for New Year's I mean you can see how much it sizzles you guys know that my lighting sucks. <laughs> so if it's sizzling here, it's really good. And I like it against my complexion. I actually have a few watches this color. And so I'm really digging the gunmetal accessories right now. So this was a win. I'll give this a 10 out of 10. I mean, you can't get any more perfect than this. This was absolutely beautiful. Next, they sent me... these earrings I'll hold one up here it's like a full turquoise look with feathers and gems there you can see and so of course it's a set there's two and I just think these are really pretty for fall um let me hold one up See, my hair is so puffy, you can't even... <laughs> well, there you get an idea. Hopefully. Um, these type of earrings do get swallowed by my massive hair, so... Um, honestly, this is kind of for when you want to put your hair up. Do you see? These are really pretty. I think these are Native American inspired, if you ask me. Um, the stones are matched. Again, they're not too heavy. They, um, 
Feel Good on the Air. I was pretty impressed by these. I didn't know what to think about them when I saw them on the website. And that's the thing with the website. Sometimes the pictures don't do these items justice. Sometimes you just have to order and you're, you're presently surprised. Um, I really like these. This is the back of the earring. And they're just really nice. Like I haven't seen earrings like this anywhere else. So very, very pleased about those. Um, oh boy. Now this necklace they sent me, I'm going to just be honest, I don't like it. When I looked at it online, I picked it and I said, oh, that's gorgeous. But here it is. It's supposed to be a collar. And it's leopard print with a faux leather look. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's got like a brushed gold look and it's got a leopard print, which this is felt. And I don't know if you guys can see, but the felt is kind of coming off. There. So like this... It's like peeling off. I don't know if you can see right there. The felt can kind of come off. And this is faux leather, which it looks it and it feels it. <laughs> it feels like faux leather. And this is the back. My problem with this necklace is how do you even get this on? Look at it. Like, I have not been able to get this necklace on. I don't know how this is even supposed to come undone it's too small for you to slip it over your head um this looks like it's about a 14 inch necklace with no extension so it's just like how is this supposed to fit you know i feel like this is a waste of money it was a nice idea it was a really nice design um i think if it was done in better quality it would be really really pretty um but i can't even figure out how to get this necklace on to be quite honest um and you guys know i have a ton of jewelry so for me to not be able to get a necklace on says a lot again like what am i supposed to do with that without bending it and breaking it and then it's here you can see the quality is not good like the leather is coming up the fake leather is coming apart so, I mean, this is pretty much garbage for me. I mean, I, I can't do anything with it. Like, you can't put it on over your head. I'm pulling. It's not opening. So, I really don't have a clue how I'm supposed to put this necklace on. So, this gets like a 2 out of 10. This is just a waste. Total waste. Anyway, <clears throat> those earrings we get like a 9 out of 10 in case I didn't say it. Continuing on, they also sent me this really pretty necklace here. It's pearl and gold. It's almost like a Cleopatra style necklace. Look at this. Like, oh my gosh. <laughs> this is so freaking gorgeous. I love this. I have worn it. It's very pretty. What I like about their jewelry is it's really substantial, but it's not too heavy. Like, when you put this on, it doesn't feel like it's weighing you down, you know what I mean? But at the same time, it's substantial, like you know you're wearing a necklace. And I just think the quality of this one is absolutely beautiful. It didn't turn colors, I didn't spray it with Krylon or anything. Um, it's just really nice, like I give this a 10 out of 10. It's completely, completely beautiful. Now I dropped something. I don't know what it is I dropped. Mm. Um, the only thing you have to look out for is some of the pearls falling off, like coming unhooked. That did happen to me when I wore it, one of the pearls that came off. So, just be looking out for that. But it's an easy fix to like reattach one of the pearls. Um, last but not least, they sent me, so this one, two, three, they sent me five items, and so this is the fifth, which I think this necklace I have seen on eBay and other places.
This is just a really pretty ethnic style necklace. And it looks black, but I don't know if you guys can see, it's actually blue. Like these beads at the bottom here are dark blue. They're beautiful. This, it's funny because this, I saw this on the website and I said, mmm, I don't know. Mmm. I'll just pick it because I didn't see anything else I liked. And when I got it, I was pleasantly surprised. The quality is there. It's very, very pretty. Like, this is something I could have worn for Halloween if I was dressed as an Egyptian. But yet, yeah, it's also something really pretty that you can just wear every day if it's your style. So, and again, it's not too heavy, but it doesn't feel chintzy. You know what I mean? Like, it has a decent weight to it. So, I like it. This, I really would give a 10 out of 10. So, overall, what are my thoughts on DHgate? Well, as I, like, adjust my bra strap. <laughs> um, if you have a really big family, this is a great place for Christmas gifts. And I suggest that you shop now because, again, you know, these items are coming from China. So, they can take up to a month to get here. Um, the shipping was pretty fast. Their shipping charges are reasonable. And again, with this website, the more you buy, the more you save. So it really doesn't make sense to go on there and buy one necklace. So again, I'm saying if you have an internet store, if you have a business, a physical business, a Facebook shop, a tr if you do flea markets or trunk shows, if you have a large family, like with 12 girls and you need to... um get 12 necklaces the more you buy them the less you spend um and so let's just say you're one of these women who likes to shop on ebay or amazon like i do if for some reason i wanted 12 of something then i would go to dhgate i wouldn't buy it from ebay i wouldn't buy it from amazon because you're going to get a better deal at dhgate um they don't just have jewelry they have electronics and clothing and all sorts of stuff um it's a really safe, secure website, you know, there's no problem. And I have ordered with them before. I used to have an internet store, and so I used to order from them. Um, they have really good customer service, so that's not an issue as well. And so, yeah, I mean, overall, I would give DHgate an 8 out of 10. I think it's worth checking out, and I will link it below, obviously. Um, you know, I think they are worth checking out. I think it's a pretty good company. Some things are hit or miss. I mean, you just have to use your best judgment. If the photo looks ridiculously photoshopped or, you know, just pay attention. If you're looking at a necklace, look at the size of the clasp first and try and get an idea of the size. Um, you know, just use your best discretion. Not everything on there is great quality. I'll just be honest. Um, you guys saw this necklace, like, I mean, if I ordered this and I had this for a business, I'd be pissed because it feels cheap, it looks cheap, and I can't even get it open. <clears throat> so, and it's like coming apart. Like, literally, I might just throw this in the garbage when this video is over because I, I do not know what to do with it. And, you know, I mean, seriously, like, you can't put it over your head. I mean, maybe I should have tried to pin it or something for Halloween. I don't know. <laughs> uh, maybe but then other pieces like this one are absolutely perfect so there you have it just use your best discretion and shop smart and again if you're going to be buying I would say more than five of something then this is where you really want to go um, I wouldn't go here and just buy one or two things I think you'll be spending a little more than you need to versus if you order one thing from like AliExpress or eBay. Um, but yes, my people with a lot of cousins or a lot of uh, sisters or people to buy for for the holidays, this is where you need to be ordering from like right now. <laughs> or, um, you know, if you, any occasion where you need bridesmaids gifts or like goodie bags if you're throwing a party and you're giving out goodie bags DHgate is definitely the place to go um, corporate gifts even if you have a bunch of corporate gifts you need to pass out 
I would highly, highly suggest DHgate. Anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoy this video. Let me know what you all think. And if you would like me to review something of yours jewelry related, just let me know and I'd be happy to do so. Thanks, guys. See you later. Bye.